Hello, welcome to the latest edition of Haley Hill Police News. It's Friday the 15th of January 2016. My name is Inspector Peter Ferry and I'm the local police and commander for Haley Hill. So, hello to you. And I think this is the first one of the new year, so happy 2016 to you all. Firstly today I'd like to pay tribute to Councillor Tim Marks, who died suddenly at the start of January. For many years Tim was the chair of the SNT public priority setting meetings that we hold in town and he steered us through some very tricky and vocal meetings in an excellent way. He was also heavily involved with Haver Hill Police behind the scenes in a lot of other ways and was always on hand to help with advice to the local police when needed. He's going to be a big loss to Haver Hill Police, to the town of Haver Hill itself and I'd like to offer my condolences to his widow Margaret and also his family. It's going to be his funeral on Tuesday at St Mary's Church in Haverhill. I think there's going to be a very large turnout from uh, the town of Haverhill to, to wish Tim goodbye. So uh, he's a sad loss to the town. Secondly today I'd like to talk to you about a robbery in Harrow Road, Haverhill at one o'clock in the morning on Friday the 8th of January, so last week. A male was walking in, in an alleyway between Layston Road and Abercorn Court in Haverhill, commonly known in the town as Dogshit Alley. Uh, um, this male was pushed uh, from behind, he was stamped on and threatened by two men. He was also hit with a, a large stick. He was robbed of £45 and has now got a bruised left hand and a bruised right foot. There was no description of the offenders because obviously it was pitch black and he couldn't really see a lot. But I'm appealing for information into who might be responsible for this nasty attack. Please ring 101 if you have any information that might lead us to the offenders. Have you heard any talk up on the estate as to who might be responsible? Uh, has anyone talked to you about the offence and can give us a reason that the offence um, might have taken place? So a man was robbed for £45. Uh, let us know if you've got any idea at all as to who might be responsible. Please ring 101. And then lastly today, it's, it's only a brief report today, Got uh, a theft from shops in Tesco's that happened in Haverhill, Tesco's in Haverhill on Wednesday afternoon on the 13th of January. That's a couple of days ago on the Wednesday. A male has walked into Tesco's with a trolley. He's gone up to the end of the very first aisle. He's picked up a 42 inch television, so a huge, great widescreen telly. He's then put it in his trolley and walked straight out of the store. The male has hidden his face with a large hat, sunglasses and a scarf. So he's been picked up on CCTV, but because of the way he's hidden himself, uh, we've got no real idea who he is. But he's described as being white, stocky, and about five foot 10 inches tall. And the hat is described as being blue with sheepskin sides. Probably the, the best way of trying to work out who this is, is we've had some information that the male is thought to be new to the town and has only been in town for a couple of weeks. So do you know who this male is? Has there been any talk in the town about a male who's stolen a 42 inch television? He's then gone to a second hand shop in town and he's tried to sell that television almost direct from Tesco's. They've obviously sent him away again. Uh, so we've got another set of CCTV but we still can't quite capture his face. He's also described as wearing a dark blue hoodie with a white puffer coat and dark blue baggy jeans. So it's quite distinctive clothing. He's got a, a blue hat with sheepskin sides. He's got a white puffer jacket as well. I can't imagine there's, there's too many uh, combinations like that about, particularly not of people that have only been in the town for a couple of weeks. So if you can give us any help at all with that, trying to identify who that male is, or if you've been offered a 42 inch telly still in its box from Tesco's, please ring 101 and ask to speak to PC 1159 Emily Bean. It's lovely, it's only a short report today, but thank you very much and I'll see you next time. Thank you.